for sneakers as told by iTunes is computer expert Martin Bishop heads a team of renegade hackers including a former CIA employee, a gadgets wizard, a young genius, and a blind sound man who are routinely hired to test security systems but Bishop's past comes back to haunt him when government agents blackmail him, blackmail him and the sneakers into carrying out a covert operation, tracking down an elusive black box. Along with his former girlfriend, Bishop team, Bishop's team retrieves the box and makes a stunning discovery. The device can break into any computer system in the world. With factions from all sides willing to kill for the powerful box, Bishop and his team embark on their most dangerous assignment ever in this exhilarating, high-tech caper. Now, not much can be really said about this movie, but all I can really say is that this movie is just a joy to watch. It is a great, it is great fun. Quirky humor and characters, good suspense and drama with good bits of action neatly tied in. Casting is perfect and each character has great moments from in the film. It is just overall a great fun and just fun to watch. I give this film three stars out of five. It may be a typical 90s thriller involving early stages of modern technology and the fear it can bring, but this film gave a great freshness to it at, that was almost kind of like a parody to the films of that time, 90s thrillers and 90s uh, technology films. I recommend this film to everyone for I can see film goers of every kind enjoying it. Also to note, this film is being adapted for television. After watching this film, I can see how this is possible and what kind of ep episodes to expect, and I am looking forward to seeing how it turns out. It's just, uh, it just they just probably need to cast the right type of actors for it, because Robert Redford had that perfect comedic delivery throughout the entire movie, and they'd have to get those quirky characteristics right and modernize just a little bit to fit, to fit today. So it would be interesting to see how they would turn it into a TV series. After the success of uh, the TV show Scorpion, I can kind of see where this would kind of go along, but hopefully it gets its own flavor. And that's all I have to say for this one. See you next time.